even and odd functions. A function f from r to r is said to be even function if f of x is equal to f of minus x. What it means is that if we replace x by minus x in the definition of function and there is no difference then that function will be called even function. Let's take an example here. Let f from r to r is defined by is defined by f of x equal to x square plus 1. Then let's find out f of minus x. f of minus x is simply wherever you see x in the definition of this function replace it by minus x. Then what will be f of minus x? That will be minus x squared plus 1. But we know that minus x squared is same as x squared. So we don't need to. We can still write it x squared plus 1. And on the left side this was f of minus x. But you can see that on the right side what we have is f of minus x is equal to if you see from 1 from 1 it is still equal to f of x so f of x is same as f of minus x so the function so the function is is even and let's take another example of this was example one example one and if we take another example example two that would be if f from r to r is defined by is defined by trigonometric function f of x is equal to cos x now since since f of minus x and it's the same thing let's call this as 1 and what will be f of minus x simply we will replace x by minus x in the definition of function so f of minus x would become equal to cos of minus x but we know from the results of trigonometry that it doesn't make any difference for cos if its angle is positive or negative cos of minus x is still same as cos of x so this is going to be equal to cos of x because cos of minus x has same value as cos of x which by 1 by equation 1 this is again equal to f of x. On the left hand side we have is f of minus x. So we see that f of minus x is again equal to f of x. So f is, is even function. Even function. These small definitions help a lot while solving many problems in mathematics. So these should be learned and now odd functions as we have seen in the definition a function f from r to r is said to be odd function if f of x is equal to minus f of x let's take an example for this function as well so example three let f from r to r be defined by be defined by f of x is equal to x cube plus x if that is the case then show that f is odd function to prove that to prove that f is odd 
add function what we are going to do is we are going to replace x by minus x replace x by minus x in definition of function in definition and let's call this definition of function as equation 1 so f of minus x would be equal to what f of minus x would be replace x by minus x wherever x appeared in the definition so this was x cube now it will be minus x cube and here it was plus x now it will be minus x and we know that if negative has power odd then it would be equal to minus x cube and this would be equal to minus x again and if we take negative common this would be minus and inside we can have x cube plus x this would be equal to minus f of x from 1 we can see that and this was f of minus x sorry f of minus x f of minus x and f of minus x now we can see that the replace when we replaced x by minus x that negative has come in front of f of x so that's why this is an odd function so f is odd function if we take another example and that example is example number four let f from r to r be defined by be defined by f of x equal to sin x show that show that f is odd function and for this we'll use the same trick let's call this as definition one and solution for f to be proved to be proved as odd function what we are going to do replace x replace x by minus x so let's do that and what will be f of minus x then f of minus x would be equal to sine of minus x but from the trigonometric identities we know that sine of minus x is equal to minus sine x and therefore what we have here is equal to minus sine x and here this is f of minus x and from definition 1 this is equal to minus f of x which is equal to f of minus x hence f is hence f is odd function odd function remember that every function doesn't have to be odd or even there are functions which are neither odd nor they are even function so it's fine there are only some function which are which can be classified as even or odd but you will see many function which are not odd function and they are not even function as well but for now we will be closing this discussion about relations and functions but we will reopen this discussion again when you come for the next course